This is a vintage 1975 Panasonic Panacolor solid state television set. As you can see, the screen is in really good shape. Though I don't know if you can see right there, but there's a little scuff right there, but that's actually no big deal. Over here are your controls. VHF, this is for television signal. UHF is for changing the channels as you can see. It starts off at channel 14 but it ends at 82. This is a color TV by the way. Here are some more controls right here. This is the this is the on and off switch. Also the volume control as you can see but in order to turn this on you pull on and then to turn it off you push the thing. Push, Q, lock color. Push, AFT, tint. Bright, contrast. Right here is the speaker. Right here is the handle for the TV. Right here is the original antenna for the TV, as you can see. This is where it goes. Right here is the original cord to it, and yes, it is not hooked up right now, as you can see, but... Anyways, this is what it looks like. And yes, it does have some scratches on it, as you can see. Or plastic peeling from it, but... It does work, but again, I say it's just not hooked up right now. Alright. Now we're going to turn the TV and show the other side of it. Uh, yeah, this thing weighs a ton, by the way. So anyway, there's the side of it. Alright. Antenna terminals. This thing right here is for if you wanted to hook up any video game console, as you can see, but or it's any cable for the TV now this thing I do believe this is original I'm not quite too sure though on there it says MT-75 so you know what I do I do believe that this is original this thing right here is not original this is actually mine I just hooked it up to this TV connector so yeah Oh, by the way, and for these two up here, it's for this. Again, it's not hooked up right now, as you can see. I will have to unscrew it, these in, in order to put these on, then screw it, the screws back in. So, yeah. Oh, let me get this out of the way so you can see this. So, anyway, here's the back of it. The model for this set is CT-215. The TV was built in August of 1975. Down here are the U-hold and H-hold. Or wait, what does that say? I can't see. I know it's dark uh, where it is. Okay, so I was right. It's V-hold and H-hold. So, yeah. Interlock. There's the plug for the TV. 
All right. Now what I'm gonna do now is hook this thing up right here. If I can do this in one hand, it might not be easy, but I'll try. Okay, there we go. Now let's go ahead and turn the TV back to where it was. If I can again, yes, this thing wastes a freaking time. But it's very cool looking though. Again, there's the antenna hooked up to the TV. Although, that part's not hooked up though, but this thing is on the TV. And in case you're wondering what I just hooked up back here is... I'm pretty sure some of you remember this thing. This is the Coleco Redofine Telesports Mini TV game from 1977. I did make a review on this thing nearly six months ago. Well, in order to do that, move the TV like this. Let's bring these two things over here. Alright. Hold on, let me check some here real quick. Alright. So right now we're going to go ahead and turn on the TV, so here we go. Turn the volume up. So this is going to be like going back in time to the 1970s, folks. What we're going to do now is turn this thing on, so here we go. As it's doing that, gonna change the brightness. Watch this. So yeah, this is what it does. And now for the contrast. As you can see, that's got a little brighter. But as I do this with the brightness, it didn't do the contrast. So what happens? Yes, it's a little staticky, though, because this thing has not been turned on for a long time. It's been at least a a few years since this thing was turned on, so I just turned it on for the first time today, and surprisingly, it worked perfect. But yes, as you can see, it works. The speakers work and everything. So we're going to go ahead and turn off the game console here. Then, contrast. Of course, nothing happens here, but as I change the brightness. Yeah, this got a little brighter, as you can see, but, but we're going to turn it back all the way down. Alright, now let's go ahead and shut it off. Alright you guys, well there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this review on this 1975 Panasonic Panacolor Solid State television set. Again, this is a color TV. Model CT-215. Built in August of 1975. So again, that's it. Now, I know what some of you are thinking that I should have just hooked the antenna up in order to show demonstrations on TV channels, but... I just want to save myself from getting copyright, so I hope you guys will understand that. So, anyways, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed this review. I'm Sakura Lombardi K Magnum 5 here, and I will see you all later. Have a good day, everybody.